before they were Packers. And that's a big, big sack. Dean Lowry. Before they were Wildcats. The tally with the catch on the run. Touchdown, Northwestern. They were pitted against each other. It's almost time for kickoff of the 7A state football championship. It was a great game, and then we got the best of them that day. <laughs> There's two future teammates playing against each other, Vitaly and Dean Lowry. There was a huge fourth down play. And huge play offensively for Wheaton South. Dean comes off the edge and just smokes me in the backfield. I And I couldn't see, so I like. Had no idea he was even coming off that side. And they're not going to get it. And I actually ended up being kind of like a Kickstarter for them then after that. Dean Lowry topped Danny Vitale in the 2011 Illinois State Championship game. But even in victory, Lowry knew his fellow Northwestern recruit would be a good one. Before that game, we had known each other and just just known the kind of player he was. And he was their whole team pretty much. He ran the ball like 30 times a game and could do everything for him. So just seeing him on film and just knowing that he'd be my teammate in a few years was pretty special. At Northwestern, Lowry and Vitelli contributed right away. And after four years with the Wildcats, the two felt they were ready for the next level. Dean and I, especially like as big weight room guys, we've always kind of pushed each other, really all four years in college. And then uh, we both kind of knew we were in that spot where we could be drafted middle rounds and rounds. Um, so having a guy like Dean to kind of help push me was just perfect. Northwestern, a lot of times the guys don't really have like NFL aspirations, but since day one, me and Dan knew that yeah. we could play in the NFL. So just have somebody to compete with and work with and have that goal with was always great through the four years there. The two were selected 60 picks apart. Lowry in the fourth round of the Packers and Vitaly in the sixth. The next time they met on the field, they were facing each other once again. When I was in Cleveland and we played the Packers too, in the back of my mind I was still thinking like this is my chance to, <laughs> you know, finally get back at Dean and we didn't, but it was worth it was a shot. Time, right? it yeah, it was worth another shot. In 2018, Vitaly was picked up by the Packers midway through the season and even cracked the active roster for five games. But Lowry knew his role would be bigger with the team in 2019. I know just from like watching um, different offenses, just kind of what Dan brings to the table too, because you see him so far in training camp, he fits our offense great because he is versatile. He can catch passes out of the backfield and that fits Coach LaFour's offense. So it made sense to me right away. Vitaly and Lowry now navigating training camp with a new head coach. Lowry recently signing an extension with the team and Vitaly turning heads as he continues to make plays. But the two still able to find moments to admire how far they've come. It's not necessarily when we're out there, it's actually when I'm watching film and stuff like that. And I always see like 94, I'm like, dang, we've been playing together for a long time now. I would say more out there, just seeing them at fullback, seeing them now working with Aaron and just seeing how they work together. It's like, damn, this is, we've come a long way, so it is pretty cool. Lowry and Vitelli expecting even more success together as their journey continues with the Packers. In Green Bay, John Duran, Fox 11 Sports.